I want to take you through a history of lawsuits that have been filed since the PLCAA so you truly get what's happening. Let's start with the first case. City of New York sues Beretta. The City of New York brought this action under public nuisance law. What they said was that Beretta specifically was selling and manufacturing guns that it knew were getting into the illegal market. The Second Circuit in New York voted in a two to one decision that the public nuisance laws were preempted by the PLCAA. Eletto versus Glock alleged the exact same scenario. California also followed the PLCAA. Alaska in 2013, the estate of Kim versus Cox, the state of Alaska said, no case against a gun store retailer for negligence. Why? PLCAA, the only lawsuit that successfully forced the gun industry to pay $1. And that was the tragic incident that happened at Sandy Hook in Connecticut. Defendant, Remington. The perfect storm came together to make this settlement possible. Remington had been suffering financially. They were in bankruptcy. Inside of the bankruptcy, in order to organize, four of their insurers had to contribute to resolve this claim. The one successful attempt, and isn't repeatable under current laws in the United States.